Ghost Secure back with another video, and today we're gonna be continuing our Discord at PY series. So, um, and before we start, I'm just gonna talk with you guys a little bit. Um, and that's because we're gonna be changing a few. I mean, I'm gonna tell you guys why I started the Discord at PY series, and it's no, it's not because you guys like voted on the poll. It's actually because uh, Discord JS is more of a private bot. It's meant for private bots because it's pretty hard to make like um what do you call it uh, the code changing and updating and stuff like that py is more for public bots for example carobot zella dank member they're all built off of python because it's better for public bots and everything like that <sighs> and that's why i haven't made like you know that much for public that much for public bot wise for um javascript uh javascript um what do you call it series but i'm not gonna bore you with that anymore uh, let's actually get straight into the code so today we're gonna be making an eight ball command as you saw in the title so what you want to do is you want to get a uh, decorator ready and how you do that is just client dot command and then right just do that and then we can do async def and then your command name so in actually Python, you can't have a command or class name starting with a number. You're gonna get an error, a compiler error. So what you want to start it off with is like anything. So you can write eight ball. I'm just gonna write eight ball, and then you wanna pass in the CTX. But what we're instead gonna do is add an alias, and that's gonna be eight ball. And we can also keep it eight b. So we have two aliases for this command, and then this is our main command, but not many people are going to be using that command. We're going to be using mostly this. Okay, now that we passed in CTX, we can actually, um, what we have to do first is, oh, my bad. Okay, we also have to pass in all and question. It's pretty hard to explain why you have to pass in all, but like question is so some it's gonna see what we put after our uh command so like you know i were to like something like um <coughs> um i can put in so d and then eight ball and then hello it's gonna look for this and it's gonna save it so as question and that's why we do it and now we're gonna get a certain list of responses so now as you know when you you know spend the eight ball it's gonna say like maybe outlook good yes reply hazy try again something like that and i actually pulled this off of wikipedia and i'll keep this in the comments down below just paste this in and let's just change a few that you can change all this around so um let's say ask again later too i don't know something like this you could just change them around um but now that we have our responses this is an array and that's what we're storing it as and uh we're gonna like just randomly pick out of one of these and that reminds me you have to do import at the top here import random because when we're randomly picking it that's what that's the module that we will be using to actually pick um the random ones now anyways let's get actually started so we can put in an away ctx dot send and this will and then open it up as um what do you call it f string now f string is like something um in regular js you can just do this and then dollar sign and then open it up like start like this actually in python right you have, you do open f and then you add stuff like that so this is how you do it so you just put an f right here and then after you put in your quotations and you can just put an a ball question oh, I don't know. question oh my bad right and then you can put an eight ball question and now discord actually has its own emoji it's an eight ball so i'm just gonna put that behind it just so it looks better and um we can put in and this we grab our question just pass it in like so because we have this if it doesn't you have to pass in in your async um in your function and then do backward slash backslash and then n to start a new line so and then 
put in right after you put in you start off with our new line so it will if this doesn't make sense you'll see what i mean right, the backslash just do it it will actually um it will put it in a different line so we'll put it under it and then put in answer and now here is where imp- now when we imported random this is where it counts because if you didn't import it you will be getting an error um so yeah what we're gonna have to do is random dot choice right so and, and then it goes into our um then we pass in responses on or our array here you can change this up if you want like five only answers then you can have i have um i think i have 20 and then five um i think it's 20 and then 10 or yes five or try again and then five or no that's how um it is for mine you can keep it whatever you want or you can just use the one i'm gonna use but anyways this is actually gonna be it for um not today's video but it's gonna be it for our command so if we just click run here and um just wait for our confirmation message here i should say drone is online and see we had we got an error so if we look at the error it was in line 40 it might be um yeah i think i changed my discord token so i'm gonna replace that and be back okay great so the bot is up um i just have to replace my discord bot token i do it every video so um somebody can't copy this and then like hack my bot and destroy my server you know just for security reasons but anyways if we open this sorry i was in my just developer portal and we run d it now we can do eight ball which is that and we got an error because question is an argument that is missing i'll check this out again and i'll see what's wrong okay so apparently nothing was missing we just have to put something after this or else it's not going to input so if we do a ball will this video get lots of views right as i see yes that's a good thing so better get lots of views you know so if we don't put anything after this it will result in an error but won't stop our code so that's okay now if we try um our other what do you call it, aliases d8 ball right and we can put in i don't know will this video get lots of likes without a doubt again a yes meaning you guys better do it and if we try our last um alias which is a b will this video get lots of comments oh it's not gonna happen but as you guys can see it still works and that's the thing with um with the bot so as you guys can see it goes into our array here and then it picks a random one out and then rep- and it um it displays it out here now you can mess around with this and make random ones as you choose but that's what i'm gonna show in this video next video will be like a band command or something so stay tuned for that and anyways till next time see ya